Hello everybody, welcome back to today's plugin tutorial video. Today we're checking out our new plugin report GUI. This is one I made a little while ago and you can see a speed coding of it on the channel from last week. A video or a tag to that will probably pop up right now on the side of your screen, but you can go check that out if you wish to. It's pretty cool. Why don't we just hop in and I'll show you the configs first and then we'll hop in game and look at everything. So our first config file, you got your update notification, you can toggle on or off, you got your main messages, these are like the main messages of the plugin, and then you got all your reported messages, which you are free to change to your liking. We aim here to make everything customizable in our plugin, so we made everything customizable. You can customize every message. In your GUI items here, you also have the exact same thing, customize anything you wish in here. Um, this is what's inside the GUI, their location, lore, name, items, all of that is customizable. Why don't we hop in game and look at what this is so we've hopped in game here um so let's take a look at the command why don't we do the command slash report <coughs> <coughs> excuse me i'm still sick and um still coughing if i talk too much so try to get this video done a little quicker than i normally do so the command is slash report you can do any player even if they're offline right now the reason we added offline player support is a player may be hacking and then we'll leave the server so we went ahead and um added the offline player support but let's take the example if i'm going to report myself here if i report myself i'm going to have options you're going to have hacking chat offense team trolling threats exactly what we have in our configure file which is available here you got all these are available right in the report menu you click one of them like hacking and it will say reported noodles for hacking your report has been sent to all on and staff the blue is what staff received the red is what you receive so noodles reported noodles yt for hacking i can do the same with an offline player let's say uh wolf I'm going to report, uh, it's punish, not report. Uh, so I can report wolf, and then I can do team trolling, and it will say noodles reported wolf for team trolling. Quite easy to use. It's um, free on spigot, just like I said. Here we go. Free on <coughs> spigot. The permission is um, report.use, and they can use the menu. Um, it's quite handy. A lot of people have liked it so far. We have some future updates planned. For new things that should improve the plugin even further, like a reload command for configure file and a few other things. If you have suggestions on what to add to the plugin, please join our Discord server. It's bghdevelopment.com slash Discord. If you're enjoying all these free plugin updates this week, make sure to like this video and leave a comment on what you would like to see updated next. <coughs> we are now on summer, or I am at least. This week alone i've released seven like seven to eight updates and like four new plugins so make sure to go check that out my voice is about to die so i'm gonna end this video as you can tell i need to go back to bed and get better i will see you in the next video thank you so much for watching and i'll see you next time goodbye